What are you doing today on this Monday, July 16th, 2018? Hope everybody enjoyed their weekend. I think I already see Nathan into the chat. I think I do. Thank you for uh, joining us, Nathan. How are you today? Thank you for being here. Uh, today, we, uh, like we said, uh, we posted to our Instagram. Hey, Warren, how are you doing? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining us. How are you both today? As I said today, uh, we're going to be doing our McDonald's McCafe Frappe beverage review. It's uh, the bottle beverage of it, not the one you just like, go buy at the, uh, the restaurant. So yeah, we'll have that review later today. Also, yeah, we wanted to share, uh, we updated our Discord uh, where we uh, have, a hey, Jason, how are you? Welcome to the stream. How was your first day back at work? I know it's probably a little bit uh, getting used to, but yeah, I know you're a three week staycation ended, but yeah, hopefully uh, you're just uh, rested and relaxed and you're, uh, you're all ready to go. Well, you should have been excited it was your first day, but thank you for joining us. It sucked. Oh, why is that? Was it another, uh, was it more drama that happened at the store? Yeah, Jason's a store manager too, and it's his first day back at work. He had a three week uh, vacation. So, uh, yeah, like I said, we'll have our McCafe Frappe review. Also, we updated our Discord uh, where we just want to give um, whoever's in our Discord server uh, just uh, general feedback on uh, for some of the voice channels I was thinking about setting up besides the general one we already have. Uh, first, uh, you guys already know it wasn't so bad, actually, but so Oh, true. Hey, Nero, how are you? Welcome to the stream. How was the rest of your uh, Defiance 2050 stream, Mike? I know you said before I left, uh, you're probably going to... Uh, you're gonna close the stream because you uh, needed some help getting past a certain uh, part with like there were so many enemies coming at you in the game. But yeah, thank you for joining us. Oh, hey, SoundCloud, oh, that's cool, Mortal Human. I don't have SoundCloud though, but yeah. Hey, Typical, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. How was the rest of your live stream on Twitch? Thank you for joining us. So yeah, I had a, yeah, I know, but uh, like you said, if you can't get past that part, you don't wanna just keep like dying at that same point just over and over again, but yeah. But it was all good, but it was a good stream overall. But thank you everybody for joining us. And again, congratulations to uh, France for winning the World Cup. Also tonight is the MLB All-Star Home Run Derby as well. Want to give our prediction for that as well, who's going to win. Oh, that's good, Tim. Yeah, you had quite a few people in there, which was good. So yeah, I know about your, uh, like you said, your currency system that you said, uh, set up on Twitch. Thank you everybody for being here. I already seen five likes on the stream. Thank you everybody for smashing that like button. Please welcome everybody into the chat. Yeah, they did. They won yesterday against Croatia 4-2. Continue to get to know everybody here. See me at the contest of genuine interest to you. Our feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions to improve the quality of the content. Mr. Moore, long time no see. Welcome, Mr. Moore. How are you today, sir? Thank you for stopping by. It's been a while. But yeah, uh, Nathan, yeah, congratulations. You hit 2200. That's good. Congratulations to you. But so I was looking at my uns. Any more PL people? You were so disloyal. Oh, I know, because uh, people don't realize you have like software where you can tell people just unsubscribe. It's kind of funny if people don't realize it, but yeah. But, you know, yeah. Twitch doesn't really like that. Surprisingly, I don't know why it's just YouTube. But for Twitch, if you uh, follow somebody on Twitch, they're nowhere near as disloyal. Or I don't know about Mixer, because I'm not on there yet. Urban, welcome to the stream. I know it's late for you, but thank you for joining us this evening. How was the rest of your Evil Within stream? I hope it wasn't too much screaming going on. I hope there wasn't too much Evil Within. But yeah, you probably conquer the evil, so it's okay. I'm uh, uh, Oh, no, it's all good, Mr. Moore. Yeah, I didn't know you moved. And, uh, oh, you're waiting for your internet to be installed? Oh, that's the worst in that time period where you got to wait. That's probably why you haven't been uploading in a while. It was evil. It was good. It was evil. <laughs> the evil within and the good. Uh, what about the, what's the counterpart? The good within. What happened to all the good within? So I noticed uh, the evil within. But uh, thank you to everybody for joining us. Yeah, like I said, we'll have our uh, McCafe Frappe Mocha beverage review coming up. It's the bottled one, not the one you get at McDonald's. Also, yeah, we'll be sharing our uh, MLB All-Star Weekend Home Run Derby uh, selection. Also, uh, we updated our Discord. Uh, just giving uh, our communities uh, feedback on, thinking about just setting up some voice channels where, for most of you already know, we do uh, voice impressions on Twitch. So I don't know if you wanted to like hear some voices, like some of those voices on our voice channels on Discord. Man, you won't believe the list one. <laughs> Three of them are in this room. Ooh. I vote donuts. Oh, no. I wish I had donuts, though, Jason. But, yeah, tomorrow at midnight it goes live UK time. Oh, okay. Oh, cool, Mr. Moore. All right. Tomorrow at midnight it goes live UK time. Okay, so it's 7 p.m. Okay, gotcha. So, so it's uh, noon. Oh, no, midnight on UK will be 7 p.m. for me. Got it. I'll probably be streaming at that time, though. But, yeah, if I can't make the live stream, at least I'll try to get part of the replay. Well, that's cool. Sugar donuts now. Ooh. Oh, uh, what type of sugar? Urban uh, brown sugar or just... Uh, know what specific type tmp gaming how are you welcome to the stream thank you for joining us how are you today 
Thank you everybody for being here. Also, yeah, um, I was thinking about also doing uh, just setting up. I'm gonna get help with that mission tomorrow. All right, cool, Mike. Yeah, because as you said before, yeah, that seemed like tougher part too. But yeah, I don't know if um, if uh, if I download it, um, are you just like in the? Uh, are you? On, I don't know if you're on multiplayer mode or just a campaign. Because I didn't like say I, I don't ever play the game, so I don't know if it's just like I just jump in right there with you. There's a sugar choice. I'm gonna basically I'm white sugar. Oh, there's like brown sugar too, Urban. Jelly donuts. Uh, no, I don't have jelly donuts. Uh. Moral human. I just have my uh, McCafe beverage, but I do actually have a uh, pie as well. That's not. It's gonna be a vote for a uh, campaign. Oh, do I have to like uh, work my way up to that, Mike? Because I don't know if I have to uh, work my way up to there and then I can play with you, or I can just jump right into the campaign and just like help you out. Because I don't know how that works. Because if it's just online, I could just jump in, join your party or whatever, and just do that. Thank you everybody for being here. Seeing six likes on the live stream. Thank you to everybody for uh, smashing that like button. Yeah, it's gotta be 21 to play with me. All right, well, I'm over 21, so check. Got that. I feel more uh, skilled already. Uh, it's in a little while, typical. We'll be doing that in a little bit. Uh, thank you, everybody, for being here. I said six likes on the live stream. Thank you, everybody, for smashing that like button. Level 21. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, no, no I'm not so skilled. Then. Oh, I got to start from the bottom then. Ooh, that might uh, take some time. Do we have any comment review? It. Oh, t lit. Oh, okay, cool, typical. But yeah, I don't know if you can, on your uh, streams, try to talk a little louder too. I know your parents don't like it when you talk too loud, but I can barely hear you on your stream. Your audio is really low, or your mic is really low. I know your parents are, don't like it when you stream or you make too much noise. Because I don't know if there's a way, um, if you could just like, um, whatever you say will appear as text in the chat. I don't think Twitch allows for that functionality. Mine? Mine what, uh, Mike? For what? No, 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 my, oh, uh, Typical's uh, live stream, not yours. You're good, you're good. I'm talking about Typical's uh, Twitch stream. He's streaming before. He was at uh, 6 p.m. No, it was uh, Typical's. Yeah. Okay, yeah, now I, I, the, now I understand what you're saying. Yeah, I just uh, was behind, now I caught up. Yeah, if you heard this, uh, it's like uh, thunder outside. Uh, but thank you, everybody, for being here. Yeah, we'll do the uh, coffee uh, review uh, for a Met Cafe, uh, Mocha Frappe review. Who might today? Oh, I know, it sounded a lot better too, Urban. Rice and beans, no. No, I wouldn't do a rice and beef review. I don't know if somebody could actually make that interesting. I'll link to Mike's stuff. It does that once in a while. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I don't know if it's just the volume was turned out because your parents don't like you making too much noise when you stream or it's just the mic itself. Let's go to what type of mic did you get, Urban? Yeah, so I have my uh, B Solo 3 wireless headphones, but I wish they like, uh, were Bluetooth compatible uh, with my PS4, but they're not. Uh, I just have like a, a web camera for my uh, PlayStation because eventually I want to get the uh, VR headset and do live streams in VR. And you need the uh, the PlayStation uh, webcam for that in order to use it. So I have that. Also, I also thought about just doing like a, probably just doing like a Discord like 101 to try to like get people more familiar with uh, using Discord and show them that's a lot better than just Skype or uh, reset to low. I'll have to turn. Oh, okay. Shooting up there. Yeah, I yeah you said that on the stream, Mike. It's like you're you're over three thousand, which is good. Yeah, plus like there's more people in the live streams too. It is, I know, Urban. I want to like oh, I want to do those live streams so bad. I have to save up for. It. I think the headset's like 300 bucks though. 300 American, which I, whatever that is in uh, uh British pounds. I think that's like what like 250 something like that. 250 uh British pounds. But yeah, eventually I want to do that as well. But those I think would just be on Twitch for the uh, VR head stream uh live streams of the VR headset. Yeah, been more people in there too. Yeah. Also, just, yeah, just, uh, also commentary as well. Yeah, too busy. yeah that's what I figured, Urban. Yeah, that's about the, uh, price of the thing. Michael, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Oh, uh, I'm sorry I couldn't make your, uh, live stream before. I'm sorry about that. I hope the 24-hour live stream went well. And you had a, I'm probably really tired after that, too. But, yeah, welcome to Michael. Thank you for joining us. Hope you're, uh, hope you're feeling better today after, uh, getting some rest of your 24-hour live stream. I'm sorry I couldn't make it. A little better. Yeah, I mean, in your commentary, too. Yeah, just, uh, in general, too, just, uh, you can just, like, uh, just, the commentary, like, just work on where not just, like, you're, uh, just more, uh, sociable and just, like, really just engaging more with the audience, but just, uh, showing that you actually really enjoy the game. You're really, uh, committed, like, just to playing it, too. Yes, I'm still talking. Yeah, I figured. Yeah, that's a long live stream. But at least you got through it, which is good. But thank you, everybody, for being here. And then, yeah, um, the MLB All-Star uh, Week actually uh, started today, um, with the Home Run Derby coming up. We'll share our uh, who we think was going to win that. PSVR, you're looking at spending over 300 pounds because of the stuff you need. That too. Uh, you're right, Mr. Moore. We also bought the uh, camera, the web camera that you need with it. That was, uh, for me, it was like 50 or 55 US dollars, which is like 40 pounds. Never do that again. Yeah. 
I definitely don't recommend 24 hour live streams. The only exception I would make is for if it's for charity or for a good cause, but ideally with that, you'd want more than one person taking turns. I mean, it's just like, it, it's just like, it's not the healthiest thing to do, but yeah, I don't know why other people would do it. If it's not for like charity, why you would do a 24 hour live stream? It's just, oh, that's brutal. I don't think I would ever do that, but you know, there's always, or if you would really are insistent on 24 hours, you just split it up into like six hours and each day for four straight days. Two hours and under now, yeah, because, oh, it's just too much, too. I think the most I've ever streamed on one platform was, like, I think five hours, something like that. And total in one day, I think it was, like, just under seven hours. And leave. Oh, as long as you give credit where credit is due, Michael, yeah, I don't mind. I didn't invent clapping, but, yeah. Which is, uh, in general, too, that's what I, four day, hours a day now, and I don't think I'm trying, oh, okay, cool, Mike. Four hours a day, so, would it be just, like, You'd either do two streams for two hours or one stream or four streams for one hour each. It's just whenever you feel like either stop uh, streaming or something like that. I don't know, just like, I don't know how many different streams would be there per day. Because if you're doing four hours a day, it all depends on uh, when you want to stop and start. Two streams, two games. Okay. Red Velvet Cheesecake. Yeah, that sounds good, Mortal Human. Stealing Verdict 20 Clapping. I am stealing. I am stealing Verdict 20 Clapping. Oh, you know, there you go. I mean, I can't stop people from uh, clapping for others. That's just our way of, like, welcoming people. Just to show them that we actually really do appreciate them stopping by. Because they deserve, people deserve to feel welcome and respected and appreciated. And that was Defiance and Fantasy Star Online, too. Yeah. And Fantasy Star... Yeah, no problem, Michael. Uh, Fantasy Star Online, too. Yeah, that's like you said, it's your all-time favorite game. I don't know. It's just, like, for me... I don't know. I'm just not... I wasn't really a big fan of it. I'd like to... Like I said, Defiance 2050 looks like a cool... Uh, Cool game. Mike is fixed it as well. I was thought I was reset back to low. I'll have to look every time. Yeah, me too. It's like uh, when I have my live messages, I fix it I, before we started or like right when I went live, I went to show all messages instead of the default, just the top messages. It's like, come on, YouTube. It's like, there's no way for me to fix it. Hey, Mad King, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Hey, Night Shim, how are you? Welcome. How are you both? Thank you for joining us. Hope you both are having a good day. But yeah, like I said, uh, sleep tight for, hey, no problem, Urban. I know it's late for you, but thanks for stopping in. Uh, sleep well, and we'll see you later. Thanks for uh, being here. High pitches. Oh, it's probably my phone charge too. I have no idea why it's, my charger's making that sound. Let me see if I can fix it too. Yeah, because I don't know why. It's only recently started happening. Let me just see if this will fix it. Because I had to put my phone on its charger just because it's uh, during a live stream, it runs low. Or it might be uh, my air conditioning. So I have no idea why it does that. It's really weird. I have, I have no clue like why my charger started doing that. Angel Sir, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining us. How are you today? Thank you for being here. But yeah, I don't know if anybody's going to be watching the uh, Home Run Derby um, for tonight's, uh, for the MLB All-Star Week. But for those who don't know, that's, um, it's uh, pretty much just a contest to see who can hit the most home runs in a specific enough time. Yeah, they changed it where um, every time you don't hit a home run for a pitch, you attempt to, you hit. It's like with a ball in a pitcher's mound, you throw it to the batter. And then uh, if they get a home run, they uh, it's one point. If not, then it's an out. Then it was like 10 outs, then your uh, round is done. But like now I think it's just a certain time limit where uh, you try to hit as many home runs as you can. Uh, good. Sorry, I've been slagging on one. No, it's all right, Angel. No worries. No worries. I'm just happy to see you now. Don't worry about it. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Racing 11 likes on the live stream. Thank you, everybody, for smashing that like button. Continue to know everybody in the chat here. See me in their contents of genuine interest to you. Our feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions that improve the quality of the content. You also know somebody's interested in the content as well. Share with them on your social media accounts. Also, we updated our Discord, just asking our community uh, if they want us to add, like, different voice channels to our Discord as well, besides just the general one, where I would just do different voice impressions with the voice channels. So that's uh, available on our Discord as well. So I got set up either, I'm probably not, like, Nightbot, but something else. Just to have like all the links like just automatically posting. I have to set that up. That'd be a lot better. Yeah, that's our channel. Uh, I think our total channel views. Thank you, Mortal Human. It's around 26,000. Let me just see if something else can happen. I've been trying to get my affiliate on Twitch. Oh, that's cool. Angel, how close are you to affiliate on Twitch? I'll tell you what, it's a lot easier uh, than it is on YouTube. It's ridiculous. They make it uh, unnecessarily hard to become monetized on YouTube. And it's all of a sudden. But, uh, yeah, we're almost at our 4,000 hours now. Well, at some point, we'll probably hit it.
But yeah, we have been a Twitch affiliate. I think now it's been, I think, oh wait, it's July 16th, so it's been three months exactly. Yeah, that'd be a good idea, Moral Human. One more task and get, oh, okay, probably, uh, is it your three average viewers, Angel? And then you got like your 50 followers, you stream seven days in the past 30 days, and you can stream for at least eight hours in the past 30 days. It's probably the, the toughest one's the average of three uh, viewers. Yeah, it can be tough too, but yeah, depending upon, um, if you just promote it enough too, and then especially um, if you have people go to your YouTube live streams, they get them over to Twitch. I know, yeah, but that was why you did the 24-hour live stream, Michael. Yeah, because you uh, got your monetization back. That's why you did the 24-hour live stream. Yeah, hopefully we can get there soon. But, you know, even then, too, I'm not really just, it's not, even if you are monetized, too, it's just a matter of just trying to improve your content, too. Like, just, yeah, I hear that high-pitched voice, too. It's really annoying. I don't know why my charger is doing that. I have no idea why. Because I only just recently started it. Because I don't know if it's just, like, this particular outlet that I have in my apartment. See if this helps too. And then also it's like pouring outside too. There we go. I do have a Twitch angel. Yes, we do have a Twitch account. So Verdict Squad now. It's our Twitch name. It's all one word. Hey, 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 Bear, how are you? Welcome to the stream. How are you doing this evening? Thank you for joining us. Like I said, yeah, this that high pitch is kind of annoying too. You can use stream elements for YouTube as manual links and timers there. Oh, I can use stream elements? Yeah. Yeah, you too, Barry. Thanks, man. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you, Angel. Thanks for following us on Twitch. I appreciate it. Thank you. I yeah, love you too, Barry. Yeah. Um, 364 watch minutes. Panther, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Hope you enjoyed the rest of your weekend, sir. Thank you for being here. This stream, uh, stream elements. Yeah, I'll have to do that too. I'll have to set that up for uh, both YouTube and Twitch. Um, I think I could set up, you can have it for both YouTube and Twitch, right? Could you use like the same uh, stream element bots or just like, uh, do you have to set it up for each separate platform? I'll have to look into that too. It's going to be a lot easier than just, uh, the links will just, uh, post themselves. Oh, nice, Andrew. Congrats to you on the comment. I relied, relied to, oh, you replied to you on the comment. Oh, okay. Uh, Bear, I didn't know you responded already. I'll look at it when I get a chance. But yeah, uh, I don't know if, uh, Swindon Town, if you're going to, uh, uh, focus just on your team, Swindon Town, for uh, for matches, or are you just going to go just uh, EPL? Are you going to do other, maybe other UEFA teams, maybe? I'll throw for about 30 minutes. I'll leave the stream running because I know you're. Oh, thanks, Panther. Appreciate it, buddy. No worries. Yeah, take your time. But yeah, appreciate you leaving this on. I think you have to set up for. Oh, okay, typical. Cool. That's right, more. I mean, you just got to keep uh, creating content and keep uh, improving on it. Take suggestions from your uh, your supporters, the people who watch. Because, uh, yeah, it's not easy to get to 4,000 hours. But, again, like, I didn't start YouTube just so I could be famous or just make a bunch of money. I have a sports show on my channel. We talk about football, soccer, seasons. Oh, okay. Gotcha, Bear. All right. So you have a separate show. All right. You have a separate one. Well, I don't know if you just focus on um, if you uh, focus on a specific league or you want to join. Um, What would I have to do to join? Um. Is it like a hangout and then we just talk? Because I don't know. Uh, some leagues I'm not as aware of as others. You call them claps. <laughs> I like that typical claps. Yeah, I don't want to say. Oh, Google Hangouts. Okay. It would depend on like uh, which uh, soccer, football team, whatever you guys want to call it, a football team we're talking about. Yeah, some of them I know more than others. So like some leagues, I don't know if it's just uh, EPL. You talk about or League One, Two, any UEFA league. Um. Because, yeah, if it's something like uh, like the Greek League or something like that, I'm not going to know much about it. Yeah, that's a lot. Well, yeah, he's been, PewDiePie's been on uh, YouTube for almost a decade. So, yeah. He's been for a long time. All the football teams. It's sports show. Oh, okay, cool, Bear. Oh, what time is it at? So, you also said, I think you talk about, do you talk about um, American football here? We just got to call, this is the NFL, this is our league. I think you said that too, yeah. But you support American football as well, and you said your team was the Broncos. So I don't know if in the fall you would talk about that as well. Also, yeah, in a little bit, we'll be doing our uh, McDonald's McCafe uh, Mocha Frappe review. It'll be 12 p.m. UK. Oh, okay, cool. All right. We'll be 5 p.m. UK time, I think, on Fridays. Uh, Bear, I think it's 5 p.m. UK time. But yeah, that's fine. Entertain 45, how are you, sir? Welcome to the stream. 
Hope you enjoyed the rest of your weekend. Thanks for joining us. Hope you're doing well. Thank you everybody for being here. I already seen 15 likes on the live stream. Thank you everybody for smashing that like button. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat. Angel, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Red Velvet. Oh, now I should have had Red Velvet cookies. Now I'm hungry. Welcome, Angel. How are you? Welcome to the stream. I have a co-host who presents with me. Oh, okay, cool, Bear. That'd be cool, yeah. I'd like to go on your show, too. So, yes, I'd be sure to uh, be as informed as I can, too. And uh, But, yeah, that sounds like a good idea, too. It kind of, like, it would sound like a... It's like a podcast, but better, too, because then you can, like, see people talking, too. It's like its own... Uh, like you said, it's a sports show, obviously, but, yeah, it's a good idea. But thank you to everybody for being here. If you didn't notice, yeah, it's like pouring rain outside now. It just only started uh, raining. Oh, cool, mortal human. And then, like I said, too, uh, we'll share our... Uh, I don't know if, uh, Entertainer, are you going to be watching the Home Run Derby tonight? Because, yeah, uh, I have a pretty good... At least uh, my prediction, I hope, uh, it just comes from like uh, one of my favorite teams in the league. Over 15 minutes long. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, yeah, I, haven't, I didn't know you up, Yeah, until you told me I didn't know you uploaded another video on this channel. Thank you to everybody for joining us. I'm doing fine as well. Thanks for asking, Angela. I'm doing fine. 45 crashes. Ooh. I didn't hear the rest of it. I'll read your Discord message. Typical. I think you said you can, like, uh, you can bet crashes or something. I didn't catch the rest of it, too. Like you said, your uh, mic audio was low. Okay, Angela. Yeah, a lot of times, too, when I'm running errands, I'll uh, be stopping by people's live streams. I'm running errands as well, so I know the feeling. But that's all right. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know the players anymore. It'll be Friday, but it don't start till the football season. Oh, okay. Well, it's a uh, preseason right now, right? So it'll probably start what? I don't know. Is it already? No, wait. Is it already passed? See, I'm not sure. It's not gonna be. In, obviously, it's not gonna be in the. Probably come August. Yep. Yeah. No, I would actually join. Then the NFL, we we'll call American football. Uh, that's the start. The season doesn't start till after Labor Day weekend. But yeah, uh, my prediction actually for the uh, MLB home run derby is gonna be Bryce Harper. I think he's gonna actually uh, take it this year. Well, I'm a fan of the Nationals too, so I may have a little bit of bias, but yeah, I think Bryce Harper is gonna take it. Then also, uh, like I said before, I'm thinking about just like uh, trying to do like uh, not only a Discord workshop, but like just try to give people some tips and pointers to just set up their Discord as well. Because uh, we only just started recently started updating it on a regular basis. Slots and roulette to bet crashes. Oh, okay. That was a cool idea, typical. I should like that idea. Everything from transfer fees. Uh, loans, probably. I'm doing fine, Angel. Thank you for asking. I know I already said it, but yeah, so uh, clued in everyone. But yeah, I think uh, right now, I think we could start with the uh, uh, Mocha Frat Pay Review. So yeah, I apologize for like the uh, high-pitched uh, noise that was in the background of my charger. I don't know why it's still doing that. Because up until recently, it's been working great. Because I have uh, multiple devices I charge simultaneously. So it actually helps with that as well. Let's see. How about sports show videos? Okay, Barry, yeah. When I get a chance to, I'll start checking those out. So I like the idea, too. I don't know how many people, different people. I know you said you have a co-host. But how many people, different people do you have on the panel? Do you just have, like, a, everybody at once? Because I know Google Hangouts... They was it like 10 or 20 or something? Hey, Team Red, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Hey, Sierra, welcome. How are you? Hang on, that's a little cars. This is what I can put right. Welcome, Team Red and Sierra. Thank you for joining us. How are you uh, both today? Okay, let's just catch up on it. For a game of Fortnite later? Um, Afterwards, I'm going to be on Twitch streaming something else. So how, uh, what time is later, uh, Team Red? Because I also have to go to the gym later today. Unless it's like really late night, but I could play for a little bit. Um. Cause like afterwards, yeah, I'm gonna be uh, like I said, I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be streaming some more Call of Duty Black Ops Three on Twitch after this. Yeah, it depends on who wants to. All right, cool. There we go. But yeah, I never noticed. There's never really an international, uh, consistently international. Too. I'm doing fine. Thanks for asking, Sierra. Sit up till three a.m. before. All right, cool. Too red. Yeah, it all depends on um, what time is later. My other oh, sorry, Angelo. Yeah, I, I turned on all messages. Uh, how is everyone doing? Oh, was there another one before that? Hey, Angelo, I'm just saw how is everyone doing? I didn't see another one. Hey, Patrick, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining us. I like the uh, feet clapping as well, too. How are you today? 
Thank you for joining us. Maybe I missed it, Angela, because I turn on all messages should be showing up on my chat, but for some reason, not all of them show up. It's kind of like when you hit the bell and it says get all notifications. Do you get all notifications? Eh, no. I don't know. The word all seems to have like a loop. So I don't know why I didn't see it. But yeah, actually, we could start with our... Uh, I got, I'll get actually reverse this so the uh, uh, image isn't mirrored. Watch the uh, comp for us. Okay, good. Okay. Clap for us. Yeah, just in a second, Team Red. Uh, we're going to be starting our uh, McCafe Boca Frappe review as well. So they're kind of uh, like Starbucks and Dunkin' Donuts. Uh, McDonald's just started recently uh, just uh, having their uh, McCafe or their uh, McCafe beverages bottled as well. All right, Team Red. Frankenberry, Blueberry. Go, Team Red. Uh, you won't be hearing uh, too many, uh, too much clapping for me at Fortnite, too. I'm not the best at it. Starbucks. Yeah. And Dunkin' Donuts. I don't know if Tim Hortons uh, has it. I don't know if they have, like, bottled beverages, too. But, yeah, I never had these before. Uh, it was a decision between mocha, vanilla, and caramel. I just went with mocha. It was on sale at the store, and I figured, you know, I'll just, uh, they're cereals. No, I know. Count Chocula. Yeah, I know, uh, Mortal Human. Frankenberry, Blueberry, Count Chocula. Yeah. I'm literally, uh, not literal. Yeah, Team Red, eh. I'm not the best at it, too. Yeah, you haven't seen me play. All right. See, I just actually shake this up a little bit, too. Because, uh, yeah, I don't know if it's a shake well, too, but, yeah, not a default. That's true. Hey, Eric, how are you? Welcome to the stream. You save any bacon and eggs for me? I can use some. Wait, I'm about to drink a, I have a McCafe Mocha Frappe uh, beverage I'm about to try. Never had these before, like I said uh, before. Just gonna shake this up a little bit too, but thank you for joining us. Hope you're having a good day today. Thank you everybody for being here. I'm seeing 16 likes on the live stream. Thank you everybody for smashing that like button. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat here. Seeing any other concepts of genuine interest to you. Offer feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions to improve the quality of the content. If you also know somebody who's interested in the content as well, share them with them on your social media accounts. Boom, boom. Bullseye, yes. Oh, if only my for, uh, my aim at Fortnite was like that. Oh. Yeah, but I don't think I'm a, this wasn't a review channel, was it? Uh. A review channel for anything? Oh, we do product reviews, but I don't, like, just have it set as only product reviews. I just did this because I never had these before, and I figured I'd share it. Uh, it'll, I'll include pancakes. And <laughs> yeah, right? Brunch. Brunch at Erica's house. I mean, come on. Who doesn't like brunch? I mean, if you want to change some of the items that you offer for brunch, but come on, brunch is a great idea. Now, if you want to have mimosas, that's up to you. I just prefer the champagne part. But anyway, yeah. Just uh, mix, shake this up a little Let's try it. Thank you for, uh, thank you, Sarah. Also on our Discord too, we updated asking our community if they want us to add voice channels, uh, different voice channels besides the general one we have, uh, where we do our different voice impressions. I don't know if, uh, because most of you already know I do voice impressions on Twitch. I used to do them here too, but uh, yeah, here I just like save my voice because it gets too tired and raspy and it starts hurting after a while. Because going into my Twitch stream, what I used to do for both YouTube and Twitch, it started hurting going into Twitch. Uh, Mortal Kombat X, no, I wish I, I need to get that game, Red. I need to get that game. I want to play it. But anyway, let's try this now. Uh, hopefully this is uh, this is pretty good. At least uh, it's good enough for me to buy. But anyway, bottoms up. All right. Thank you for the Discord link, Sierra. That wasn't too bad. I thought I did a good job. Oh yeah, uh, a solid snake. Yeah. It's like <laughs> I was uh, I was gonna say in the chat like uh, Mike, Mike, Mike. If you uh, got knocked out, I was gonna do that. Where's the hot water cereal? Oh, no, I'm not the uh, person from Wales that you know. Yeah, you met, it was your story. It was in, you were playing GTA 3. You met somebody from Wales where they like to have their cereal with hot water. Uh, no, 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 not today. Ooh, Bob Marley, red, red wine. $10 for the month. Ooh, that's not bad. Is it available on the, uh, the PlayStation Store, uh, Red? No problem, Sierra. Oh, Jason Voorhees versus Leatherface. Isn't that, isn't that a Mortal Kombat fight? I think that is. Or like you can get different characters and there's uh, some of them. Sound. Sound. <laughs> like what sound, Mike? PS Plus. Oh, okay. I have a PS, a PS Plus uh, a subscription, yeah. I'll think about buying it. Only, yeah. Uh, are you into anime? Bro? Uh, it depends on the anime, uh, Bear. It depends. Not all anime I like. But uh, something like Van Helsing I used to watch uh, before it went off the air. It is, Team Red. Uh, Angel, my PSN is MBF 1128. This is one more reason why I need to set up either um, 
Either like something like Nightbot where they throw in the links for us. Yeah. Yeah, that would be the uh, command to uh, bear. But yeah, it's uh, MBF1128. MBF1128. Yeah, I got to get that uh, set up too for our chat. Then also, yeah, for, I don't know, probably for Twitch too. We'll have to do that. I would add text stream red, but um, for some reason with my tablet, when I go into the live stream, I can't chat from it with my uh, Amazon tablet. I don't know why. And also today, speaking of Amazon, today's Amazon Prime Day. I was looking at something too. I was looking at a phone that was like 50% off. And then from my phone right here, I can't because it'll jump me out of the live stream and will end the live stream. So yeah, I could do that as well, but I can't do that as well, but, you know. But for, I'll probably just like set up the, uh, give the, uh, the stream links. So, yep. Yes, Angel. Yes. Oh, that's cool, more human. I had mine since uh, 2000, 2011. Angel, yes. That's my PSN ID. What games do I play? Uh, play most of everything. Everything from like uh, racing, sports, uh, some RPGs, depending on them. FPS, action, fighting, ARK. No, eh, I'm not really an ARK fan. Awesome, Angel. I don't know why. ARK, I don't know. Just uh, not really my kind of game. And obviously, Fortnite I play. Right now, I'm playing uh, Cod BL3, GTA. Yep. Almost seven years coming up in September. It'll be seven years in uh, September. Yeah, Twitter's been around since, I think, 2007. Something like that. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Seeing 17 likes on a live stream. Thank you, everybody, for smashing that like button. Did you get to know everybody in the chat here? See if any of their contents are genuine interest to you. Offer feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions uh, to help improve the quality of the content. If you know somebody who's interested, share them with them on your social media accounts. Agreed, Red. Yeah, I like it. That's fun. So I'm not good at it, but I'm going to get better at it. But it makes for uh, entertainment for Beavis and Butthead on Twitch. And for those who already know, for Twitch, we do our impressions of Beavis and Butthead and other characters on Twitch. And we might uh, add them to Discord, too, depending upon uh, if our Discord community wants me to add the uh, voice channels, along with our general voice channel. Yep. I know more human. Yeah. Well, I'm older than you, so yeah. That's ex that's to be expected. I would think uh, for some of these, at least I had more opportunity to either sign up for accounts or do stuff before that you did, because I'm older than you. But anyway, this McKevy breakfast, uh, yeah, it's not bad overall. I just wish it tasted more uh, like what you would get at like uh, at a McDonald's. But yeah, I would like to see, just in general, whether it's Starbucks, Dunkin' Donuts, or McCafe, I would like to see these, like you could also pre-order, uh, like you can at a coffee house or Starbucks or wherever. You could actually uh, customize your drink. My Wonder Wash <laughs> can be included. Oh, can be included 0% tax. <laughs> there. You mean VAT or VAR? I thought you meant VAT. No, because it's yeah, VAT. <laughs> Dash EX, Twitter for almost 10 years. Oh, I didn't know that more human. That's cool. Yeah, what I would like to see is, uh, whether it's Starbucks or McDonald's or Dunkin' Donuts, that they would be able to, you can order it online and then just have these, uh, yeah, that's what I figured you meant, value-added tax, uh, Bear. It's like uh, European, it's like the sales tax so is what VAT is to Europe. Uh, Pre-order or like uh, customize your drinks in advance so you don't just get the general mocha, frappe, whatever they use come as normal without any customization. That's what I would like to see from just McDonald's, Starbucks, Dunkin' Donuts, but like in the bottle form like this. Overall, it's not too bad, but yeah, that's like one improvement they can make. But yeah, I think it's at the store. It's like uh, two, three dollars uh, retail at the store. This I had to deal with was like only 49 cents at the store. So I figured, you know, I'll try it. Guys, uh, get our own personal verdict on this as well. It's one of the reasons why we have the Canadian verdict. One. Hey, Slippery Fish, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining us. How are you today? We're just reviewing uh, this uh, McDonald's McCafe Mocha Frappe beverage. I know it's like mirrored right now. You see it too. But yeah, just reviewing this right now. Like I said, uh, I would just hope like either uh, they would let you uh, pre-order like customized like beverages like this. Just in advance either like pre-order it either from, I don't know, either like uh, through a different retailer or because they don't have like bottling too at the restaurants too. That's the part that would probably be difficult. All right. Good to hear, Slippery Fish. Yeah, I heard that, Moral Human. Yeah, uh, they got Mark Summers, the original host, to actually host it. I was like, oh, man. But uh, I would like to see, like, more. I would like to see, uh, speaking of, Tyler, how are you? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Hope you, uh, yeah, you're, you're not uh, getting sick again, right? You're feeling better. But thanks for being here. Hopefully you can get back to your marathon training as well. You got your marathon coming up in October. But, yeah, overall for this, I would just like to see, like, more customization and, like, just you being able to, like, uh, pre-order like a, a customized drink that you would normally get either at the restaurant or like coffee house or wherever you uh, go. But right, it's not too bad. I just like, uh, do you run the day or the day runs you, honey? Ooh, I like that bear. 
Yeah, I'm good. No, it's, yeah, me too, uh, Tyler. There's actually a pouring uh, rain before, and he heard some thunder in the background. Yeah, there's a storm that just passed through here. I don't know if it's just like a, a random storm that just popped up, or uh, I don't know if it's like a line of storms. I didn't check the uh, radar. But thank you to everybody for being here. 12 20 a.m. Yeah, I know. It's uh, five hours ahead in the UK. But yeah, I appreciate you staying up with us, Bear. But yeah, the sports show, yeah. I like to be part of it too when uh, your, uh, football season starts in August. I'm sure Tyler here is a big football fan as well. So, like you said, if you know of, uh, like you told me, if you know any of uh, other people here who are big football fans, Tyler's uh, definitely one of those people. You can talk about, uh, you know, he's a Barcelona fan, Shane Dawson. I don't know who Shane Dawson is. Again, yeah, some of. I know some uh, football teams more than others. Yeah, that's right. See, I don't know about Tim Horton says uh, something like this, like a bottle of beverages that you couldn't, instead of just going to uh, Tim Horton's restaurant, just to uh, get uh, one of their drinks in a bottle. But I'd like to see that eventually where you can like, uh, pre-order customized uh, drinks, whatever you can. Barca, yep, Barca. Rubbish, rubbish, rubbish. Oh, That'd be a good uh, discussion to have. Talk about here. Why is Barcelona good versus why are they uh, trash or rubbish or whatever you want to call it? Uh oh. I don't know. With the Ronaldo fanboys, either now, I don't know. Because he was with Real Madrid. I forget. Was he, uh... oh, I just forgot where he went. They just traded him. Yeah. All right. No problem, Entertain. See you later. Thanks for being here. Arthur from Grimillo and Langlet from Sevilla. Oh, I didn't know they had his channel since 2005. Oh, okay. I didn't know who Shane Dawson was. Ronaldo is an old granddad. Yeah, pretty bear. That's a yeah. He's the uh, he was the golden child of the World Cup. Yeah, no problem, Entertain. I'll see you over on Twitch. We'll be sharing some more Call of Duty Black Ops 3. We'll have our uh, Beavis and Butthead characters as always join us. And also, we updated our Discord, asking our Discord community if they want us to include uh, different voice channels where we have like a Beavis voice channel, a Butthead voice channel, and uh, other voices that we do. Included his channel is up today. Okay, cool, more human, nice. But yeah, overall here I would say uh, personal overall verdict uh, for this uh, Mid Cafe Mocha Frappe beverage. Overall, it isn't bad too, but more customization would help to stand out more. Um, now, depending upon uh, if uh, bottle beverages for coffee are more your preference versus just going to a coffee shop or to a coffee house for to have like a barista make your own drink. That all depends on. Uh, how much value you would get out of this as well. This would be just good. Uh, just If it's especially on sale like we did, it's definitely uh, be more convenient. But overall, if they can make this more like you can get at, uh, in this case, a McCafe, part of the shop at McDonald's, trying to push to, oh, I agree. Yeah, man, no sugar tax included. <laughs> Actually, uh, sugar, yeah. Uh, if you go to New York, though, they try to do that. I think they're trying to do it in New York City. 1902,000. Oh, I know. And uh, yeah, Duncan and... Uh, uh, McDonald's especially, yeah. They're try, really trying to get in uh, Starbucks uh, space there because they figured Starbucks uh, essentially cornered the market before with their Frappuccinos and double shot espressos and all that. Oh, cool, Andrew. What was the other game you beat? That's cool. But, yeah. But overall, yeah, if they can make this more like the... Uh, that's why I think uh, uh, Dunkin' Donuts and McDonald's have an opportunity to make it more like uh, you would get like, freshly made at their uh, restaurants. A nice cap. Ooh, nice, Tyler. Yeah, does Tim Hortons have something like this, Tyler? I haven't been there in a while. We don't have that many of them around here in the U.S., but yeah, I've been there before, even when I'm around the U.S. Canadian board, Canada board, when I've been to Canada. Like I said before, I have a family in Canada. But yeah, but overall, like it's not a bad drink, but just like uh, to help them stand out more, they should definitely make it more like uh, you would get at, like at the restaurant, like in this case, the McCafe uh, coffee shop portion of the McDonald's. Because the McCafe brand, brand's been around for 25 years, actually. It started in 1983. I think it's started in Australia, I want to say. That's one of them, Acorns. What about acorns, more human? Good, you can have different flavors in your ice cap. Oh, that's cool, Tyler. Batman Arkham City. Ooh, that's a good game. Oh, for sure, entertained. Yeah, because uh, Starbucks for a while cornered it, and now Starbucks is struggling to uh, keep up. And now they have so much uh, physical infrastructure with all the restaurants that they have, like McDonald's. McDonald's experienced this too, where they had to uh, cut back on the number of restaurants they had, because especially for McDonald's, food, quality uh, started slipping, and there were just too many restaurants, and then quality control suffered, and they had to close a bunch of them. Right now, Starbucks got rid of the Tiavana brand not too long ago. Tiavana, however you pronounce it. Because right now, I think that that's going to be a big issue that they're going to face with Starbucks. So they have so many different stores, too. And they're trying to do, like, the whole, like, these experimental coffee shops as well. I forget what it's called. Like, uh, not artisan shops. What are they called? No copyright is intended. Yeah, no copyright is intended. All rights are reserved to respect the owners. No copyright is intended. This is not a sponsor. I know we did, like, talk about that, but the World Cup. 
But I don't know. McDonald's sponsored that as well. Not a sponsor yet. <laughs> yeah, not a sponsor. <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm going to stream Arkham Knight today. Arkham Knight. Okay. Oh, that's cool, Angel. What's your, uh, what was your favorite part of the game? Do you just like all, most of the Batman games? Or just like, you like this one in particular? Because I think it's... Uh, which is the one? I forget, I forget it too. I think it's like uh, PS4. This be not sponsored, right? More of it, yeah. Uh, I think it's the PS4 version. It's the one that's like a lot of glitches and bugs in it. And the PC version, I think, was uh, good. Or maybe I got that reversed. I always forget too. There's always like there was one. It's like uh, we try to port um, what was made for a PC game to a uh, console. Consoles, like I said, they don't have like all the power and then the processing power and the graphics to really handle what it was built for a PC game. Because, too, ideally, if you really like games, too, I would uh, definitely recommend having both. Now, I would like to have a gaming PC someday. Just have to save up the money for it. But, yeah, there are a lot of games that were on PC that are good there. But then you try to uh, port them over to console, they turn out terrible. Or a lot worse than the PC version. But, yeah, overall, so the McCafe uh, beverage here, too. I would just like them to see it uh, be more like what you would get at a McDonald's, which is freshly made for you. These just, like, uh, they're definitely not bad. Burger King. Oh, that depends on uh, what you're trying to get. More of a human. But yeah, Burger King 2, I'm surprised they're not trying to step up more with breakfast. Alphonse Ariel and the French squad. He's a Filipino goal. Can we were playing for them now? He has more. Oh, I didn't know that, Tyler. Yeah, I don't know who Alphonse Ariel that was. Not sure who he was. Yeah. Yeah, he won without even playing. Yeah, he's part of the, uh, was part of the national team. So yeah, he wins. Gets his medal. Gets uh, to lift the trophy up. But I do feel like like most of these bottle beverages too, and I think Starbucks has and Dunkin' Donuts has this issue too. It's kind of like they just have like a base of just either they put coffee or just either put like more milk or cream or something like that. And they try to add what normally would be like for fresher coffee, but it just uh, doesn't taste fresh enough to me personally. But that's like all bottle. It's not just like uh, this McCafe beverage in particular, but you know, that's my personal verdict on it as well. I don't know if you guys have had it yet or not, but these bottle beverages as well. I just had, like, Starbucks and uh, McDonald's, too. I never tried. I don't think I've ever had the Dunkin' Donuts one. But, anyway, yeah. Quadruple Whopper. Yeah, they need to have that. You have single, double, and triple. Or just have a home run Whopper for the MLB All-Star game. Home run Whopper. So, I know. So, I don't know if you already said your predictions. If you have, can you? Oh, went Alcantar. Awesome. Welcome, Carlos. Welcome to the stream. Bryce Harper uh, for the home run derby. I'm going to say Bryce Harper for the All-Star uh, home run derby tonight. I'm saying Bryce Harper. For the All-Star game overall, I was going to wait until we were closer to the date. But, uh, no, I know Bryce Harper's going to be batting sixth. I'm actually, uh, I forget who's pitching too for the AL. I'm thinking that the AL is probably going to win. Just because overall, I think they have the better pitching. Yeah, me either, Tyler. I haven't had Burger King like in a while either. But quadruple Whopper would sound good. Or home run Whopper, you call it that. But yeah, uh, Bryce Harper, uh, Carlos. But thank you for joining. Hope you're having a good day today. Thank you for being here. And also, we just uh, were having a review of our Mc, uh, McCafe Mocha Frappe beverage here. So the bottled beverage here. Instead of just like getting it at McDonald's, you just uh, get the one here. But yeah, honestly, I'm going with Bryce Harper. That's going to be my pick for tonight. And yeah, we also made our World Cup predictions before as well. Now, initially, before the World Cup started, you know, our first pick didn't do so well. I knew it was a long shot, but anyway. But yeah, France ended up winning the World Cup. And I think uh, Tour de France is still going on now. I didn't catch the UFC fights from last weekend either. So, but, uh, yeah, but still, uh, Miocic, uh, Stipe uh, versus Cormier. That was insane. <laughs> One round knockout by Cormier. And yeah, so I'm a bias to win, even though Harper has home plate, basically. Yeah, and it's in D.C. too, because uh, Bryce is going to have home field advantage, literally, because it's in D.C., the All-Star break, uh, the whole All-Star weekend. Who's there, Mortal Human? You're a cup of bias? All right, that's fair. But yeah, overall, I think the Cardinals, too, haven't been too consistent this year. I think the Cubs have a good chance of, uh, can I actually come back and actually, like, uh, just take the Central? Just look up the current standings right now. But yeah, I'm, uh, plus, I'm, a, I'm more of a Nationals fan, too, for my NL team. Uh, and plus, like, like I said, I'm a big Bryce Harper fan, too. I have a little bit of bias, but, you know, I think, Bar I think Bryce is going to, he's gonna if he's not going to win, he's going to make it really interesting. Let's just take a quick look at the MLB standings. So I think the Cubs are... I don't think the Pirates are leading. And the Brewers, too, kind of fell off as well. And then the Astros are in the AL West. They have been for, like, a couple years now. 
Hey, Patrick. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, Indians are still at the top. Yeah, the Cubs are at the top. Okay. That's what I figured. Blue Jays, the World Cup started. Oh, yeah, I can show you right now, Tyler. Uh, Blue Jays right now, yeah, they're in fourth. But, I mean, the only team that they're beating... <laughs> yeah, the only team that they're uh, facing up against is the Orioles, and they're pretty much trash this year. The Baltimore Orioles are trash this year. That's an understatement, though. But I won't get into that. But, yeah, because they're leading the division. Ooh, what pizza did you get, Sierra? Let me guess. This is it just pepperoni? Is it just the one-topping pepperoni, or is it plain cheese? But, yeah, the Cardinals, yeah, the Cardinals kind of fell off, too. The Bur Okay. Yeah, the Cubs are still leading the division. That's what I thought. I thought at first maybe the Brewers were a little ahead, but yeah. Because uh, Pirates and Cubs, or I'm sorry, the Cardinals, yeah. Playing cheats is what I figured. Oh, that's cool, Patrick. Does she already know about it? Or am I talking to her right now? Or Chally, uh, using your channel. And I can't believe, oh yeah, and the Reds too. What's your thoughts? Will the Cubs win this year? Um, World Series, no, because there are just too many good teams in the AL that can beat them. Uh, just for example, you have the Yankees and Red Sox. Just for an example, do these in fourth. Nice. Yeah, I guess I'll only beating the Orioles. I know, Tyler. Yeah, you should be really proud. Yeah, not the best team. But yeah, Yankees and Red Sox, uh, if they end up going to the World Series, I just see them like, just beating the Cubs. Even the Mariners, too. I think, doing pretty, I think it's the Mariners. Yeah, the Astros. That's the other team. But then the Astros. The Mariners, too, yeah, could definitely make a run at them as well. But in the NL, if the Cubs, uh, they're a... Uh, they're either biased to if he plays well. They're pitching. I think they have like at least a chance to win the pennant. Now, in the NL East, it depends. Uh, you could have... Because, uh, I don't know, the Nationals have been really inconsistent. Mets and Astros. Yeah, Astros are like, yeah, they're, yeah their pitching's like their best... Uh, one of their... It's like their biggest assets is uh, their pitching, too, with uh, Verlander as well. But, yeah. But, yeah, I don't see, like, any other teams here, too. Maybe... <sighs> Yeah, because like any other team, too, yeah, the Cubs are just overall, they're leading. Yeah, they're the best team in the NL. But really, there's like there's like no real standout team. Maybe the Cubs can break away in the second half of the season, which there's definitely a good chance they can do that. But yeah, I just, uh, with the Nationals, too, yeah, we're at 500. So yeah, we've kind of been falling off, too. We've been really inconsistent at best. But I think uh, hopefully the break is something that we need. And Bryce Harper can actually win the home run over. Like, I think he's going to. Astro games have been crazy this year. They're fun to watch towards the end. Yeah. Yeah, especially, yeah, because also their pitching also holds up, too. And uh, I haven't been watching too many Astros games, too. I just saw, um, I was watching, actually, the Reds uh, in the Indians game, too, when the Indians blew a four-run lead in the ninth, which I thought was just funny. And the uh, Reds scored seven runs in the ninth. And I think uh, the Indians were playing the Yankees uh, this past weekend. Because I, oh, I forget uh, Knicks and Lakers. Ooh. Yeah, the Lakers are definitely going to do a lot better this year, uh, Mortal Human. They're definitely going to do a lot better. I don't know, uh, uh, Bear, if you're still here, this is a good uh, warm-up for our sports show. Now, we're not talking too much about uh, uh, football, or uh, soccer, as we call it in the U.S. Hey, Chris, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining us today. Hope you're doing well today. Thank you for being here. You know, the Yan oh, yeah, Yankees did lose yesterday. All right. Yeah, but I think they still, Yankees still took five out of seven for um, the Indians, too, in their uh, season series for all the games they play this season. Because, uh, the Yankees swept the Indians when they were at Yankee Stadium, and then uh, they split this uh, the four-game series uh, when they were in Cleveland. Oh, probably Tyler. Oh, yeah. You know, he is in the Lake. Yeah, he is already with the Lakers, uh, more human. Yeah, the Lakers. Uh, I don't know if the Lakers are going to be the favorite. I think it's still going to be the Warriors. I think the Warriors will still beat the Lakers. Stephen Curry, Clay Thompson, Kevin Durant. Now they have DeMarcus Cousins. Yeah. I think uh, if Iguodala is actually healthy, but yeah, they're game over. If they can only carry so much, maybe they'll go to a conference... Yeah, I agree, Carlos. I agree. Because uh, even with uh, this LeBron as your uh, centerpiece of your team, even with uh, Lonzo Ball and you have a Kazuma, I still don't think that's going to be enough to carry them. Because uh, we've been this before with LeBron. It doesn't matter if he's in L.A., Miami, Cleveland. doesn't really matter where he's at. Strahan? Yeah. Not a big Strahan fan. Because uh, given the football team that I like, not a big Strahan fan. But, yeah, it's going to be the same thing with like, Cleveland. He's going to try to put too much on his back and his shoulders and... He's not going to carry the team by himself, especially if you have the same division or the same conference with the Warriors and Rockets. Because the Rockets, I still said it last year, had Chris Paul not gotten hurt, the Warriors would not have made the finals. Because the Rockets were up 3-2 to two in the conference finals in the West. Chris Paul got hurt, and then they lost the last two, and then uh, got knocked out. Which I was kind of surprised with the Cavs that they got swept. They should have won one of those games, at least. 
Champions League? Oh, yeah, Champions League should be fun, Tyler. But, yeah. I mean, right now, really, uh, the way the Nationals are going this season as well, uh, Bryce Harper winning the home run derby is going to be uh, probably going to be the highlight so far because I don't see us uh, – because we don't have a strong division, though. Neither do those the AL Central, but that's a whole other story. But, yeah. I mean, with uh, our division, yeah, the Phil I can't believe the Phillies are actually – I've never seen the Phil uh, the Phillies actually uh, recently actually done this cons uh, well I guess not really well star division is not really the strongest but yeah I mean like I said I think how many games we okay well, I mean yeah we're only five and a half back Juventus ooh um yeah first of all Juventus is essentially the New York Yankees of uh, football or soccer as we call it in the U S that's what Juventus pretty much is so it's no surprise to me that Cristiano Ronaldo would go to Juventus I'm kind of surprised they uh, let him go to Real Madrid. Oh, Amazon Smile. Yes, Chris, thank you. I was thinking about uh, Shine Weather. How are you? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining us. How are you? Uh, for those who are new here, uh, when people enter the live stream, I clap for them. I applaud for them to show our appreciation for them stopping by. Uh, yeah, Ronaldo, too, going to Juventus. I didn't think, it, I really, before maybe a year or two ago, I didn't think it would happen. But, yeah, Juventus is essentially the New York Yankees of football. Or, like I said, soccer, we call it here in the U.S. Well, they'll pretty much buy the best players and try to be the best. And that's why everybody likes them in Serie A, which is the top Italian of uh, football league yeah but uh for italian for syria uh my favorite team is actually ac we haven't done very well in the past two seasons especially enter is enter has pretty much been uh kicking our uh, behinds uh pretty much uh, for the majority of the matches that we have with them in the past few years yeah i mean but too juventus tries to buy all the best players like i said they're the yankees of football first try to buy the best but les Ebre, it's uh there's another name for them by Italian, which is uh, the Zebras. It's translated because their kit has black and white stripes. Their traditional kit, anyway. Their jerseys have black and white stripes, like a zebra. But, yeah. I, I guess look back, back to the whole tax evasion thing. Oh, just it's your first time. Pay a fine. We agree you don't have to go to prison. That's okay. Yeah. Because, uh... I forget who just not went to Real Madrid to replace Ronaldo. I just forgot. Oh, it was on the top of my head. Who was it that, uh... Plays Ronaldo now with Real Madrid. Jude has spent this amount of hasn't spent this since they bought you good. I say Wikis. See that will still not win the champion. Yeah, I don't think they'll win either. Um they'll still probably make another run too at it as well. Like uh, most of the time. J Man, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Welcome J Man Show. How are you today? Thank you for joining us. Hope you had a good weekend. But yeah, um Bayern and a Bayern. Barca, Barca, I don't know if they're going to do better this uh, coming season. It's probably going to be like uh, Man U, Bayern, um, so Real Madrid, Juventus maybe can make a run, but I don't think uh, they're going to really But Juventus is kind of like the whole, their whole fan base, I would just like to say, is like a little more, a uh, bit more smug and a bit more arrogant. But yeah, uh, Chris, like I was saying before for your question, uh, for Amazon Prime, I was looking at a phone that was 50% off. It was 128 gigs of memory. Now, I don't think it's like a, it's not a Samsung or an iPhone, but it was only like 250 bucks. And then also with the Amazon Smile program too, you can actually have it set up where um, qualified purchase from Amazon, 0.5% uh, of uh, what you spend will actually go to a charity of your choice. That's not really uh, actually well advertised or well known, but for we're now back at Man U. To be, yeah, I only see him at Man U. Yeah, that would've been, uh, that would've been better. I didn't want to see him go to Juventus. Like, oh. And Juventus is like some of their fans are some of the biggest egos that you would ever see. But that's just only my opinion. Copa Stubis. I don't know about that channel. I've heard of the channel Mortal Human, but I'm not too familiar with it. And Juventus too. Some of their fans too. Like uh, it's more than Inter. Not like I said. I'm more of an AC fan. They have more of a ego to them. And now with Ronaldo too, with one of the most egotistical players in all of football, not going to Juventus. Yeah. Oh, well, I mean, they'll uh, have a lot in common. But those are oh, Ronaldo fanboys. I don't know. Hey, yeah, he did. Yeah. He's been there before. But it'll be interesting to see how uh, Ronaldo will play. I mean, he's... I wouldn't even consider him out of his prime right now. Because, like, right now, what is he? Like, around 30? He's in his early 30s. On the come-up. Yeah, I heard that, too. Yeah. Because I don't think... Uh, I don't think uh, Man U... is really going to do as well as everybody. He hit 11. Oh, okay, more human. I didn't know that. Yeah, the EPL. Some of the teams. Who would you want to? Uh, who would you want to Real Madrid? Hazard. Oh, Mbappe. Mbappe. One, he's 19. He just won the World Cup. He's uh, already on the uh, up and up, to say the least. Neymar. If he didn't dive so much, then I probably he'd be my second choice. But he dives too much. 
I feel like Mbappe, even though he's younger too, I think he can duck himself a lot more. And he just feels like, uh, one, I think he, like Mbappe too, even though he's younger, I think he's more of a team player too than Neymar. Neymar tries to do too much by himself. Because when you're trying to build a younger squad too, it's more important too that, that all the players work together. It's not enough to just have talent and youth. You have to have that uh, mesh together as one squad. Ooh, nacho, Doritos nacho cheese. But yeah, like I said, uh, yeah. Mbappe, and yeah, he's played a lot better than uh, Neymar and Ronaldo in the uh, World Cup. I wish Mbappe made more of a run at the Golden Boot. Uh, I think Harry Kane ended up winning the Golden Boot. He was at six goals. Lukaku uh, from Belgium, I think he was still at four. He didn't score again, even after a third place match against England. But yeah. But, uh, you know, Wayne Rooney, too, didn't play for DC United. Uh, DC United played yesterday, but Wayne Rooney wasn't in the lineup. But uh, Mbappe so fast, no one could stop. Oh, agreed, Carlos, yeah. They were diving and rolling. Oh, y- yeah. <laughs> I wonder if there's any Ronaldo memes of uh, just saying, like, well, you know, it's like, uh, or like something about, like, there's a tax evasion charge for not paying, uh, like, so much uh, tax in euros or whatever it was. I how much it was that he uh, had to pay in the fine. But it was, like, so much uh, money that he should have paid in taxes but didn't. But, yeah, but uh, definitely about my squad, too. But more importantly, which is Mbappe, I wouldn't want a, a group of young players to be sussy. Kazita. Angel, yes, agree. Yes. Bryce is going to win the Derby tonight. I agree. Welcome to the stream. How are you tonight? Thank you for joining us. Yeah, I said it too. Bryce is going to win. Plus, he's got home field advantage, like I was saying. Uh, I was saying before. I don't know why well, you just joined us, too. Yeah, that's why I said as well. I was just saying that before to uh, Carlos. This is in D.C., but right now, yeah, the whole team is a Nationals fan. We definitely need this one. I'm more of a Nationals fan. I may be a little biased, but still, we're off, we're 500. So, yeah, we definitely need this. We started off the season uh, somewhat strong, but then we just started falling off. Because, uh, one, we can't finish games. And, two, our offense needs to be more consistent. Our batting needs to be more consistent. And Because uh, we don't have a tough division. We should be winning these games, too. We can win against the Mets, especially. Come on. How come I don't support them? Uh... Mostly because I just don't care for the team, really. Um, I supported them more in the 90s. There, was like, there were, like, players that actually, like, uh, were fun watching. Um, for the Indians, too, I know my dad met Jim Tomey once. He was, like, a, one of our, like, our best players when he was with the Indians. Hey, no problem, Mortal Human. Thanks for stopping into the stream. Thanks for being here. I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for being here. Have a good night. I was a big Jim Tomey fan growing up. Yeah, and my dad met him, too. Like, I thought it was like a, just more of a class act uh, based upon what my, uh, my dad's impression of him. And he was like humble. Even though he's like making millions of dollars, he was just like somebody you can just like, uh, very approachable. Just somebody you can easily talk to. And he's like, he's down to earth, which I like. Yeah, he, oh man. He was one of my favorites growing up. I know your dad supports the Indians too, so I don't know if your dad would want me to uh, hear that. I'm just seeing outside. There's like a huge like a uh, rainstorm right now. There's a lot of wind. Manny's getting traded to. Uh, I don't know. It's a good question. Uh, I met with Alec Ortiz in New York. Why? Oh, that's cool, Tyler. We met Arod. What'd your dad think of him? I don't know, Angel. That's a good question. Um. I remember reading about it a little bit. I'm not too informed about that. I was just following more like the World Cup like, caught more of my attention so I just missed the whole where's the uh, man gonna end up but I don't know uh, he's awesome his bank skills yeah I agree even with the whole steroids thing with A-Rod but still he's a good player and so yeah that's like a storm's brewing outside too if you uh, heard that uh, thunder Thank you, everybody, uh, for joining us. Seeing 20 likes on the live stream. Thank you, everybody, for smashing that like button. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat here. See if any of their contents of genuine interest to you. Our feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions to improve the quality of content. You can also have somebody who's interested in the content as well. Share with them on your social media accounts. Yeah. I thought it was just like a passing storm, but I don't know if it's just like uh, there's a line of storms, like I said before. I didn't get a chance to look at the radar. But yeah, it'll be interesting to see where Manny ends up. I just want, my, I just want AC to actually be competitive again. How often do I go live? Uh, I go live six days a week. I will usually go live, um, usually uh, somewhere around 6.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on YouTube, and then I'm on Twitch afterwards. It's uh, six days a week, every day but Saturdays. That's when I usually go live on here. But yeah, I definitely want to uh, try to catch the home run derby as well, too. Just do an analysis of that. 
Oh, Angel agreed. I'd like to see... Um, oh, thank you, Angel. Thanks for sharing. I appreciate it. I would like to see all the old greats. Uh, Joe DiMaggio, Babe Ruth, uh, Roger Maris. Um, if you want to include McGuire and Sosa, I imagine as a Cubs fan, Carl, so yeah, you probably want a Twitch name the same as your channel. Uh, it's Verdict Squad Now. It's uh, Verdict Squad Now, all one word. It's my Twitch name. So I don't know if one of our moderators could put the link to our Twitch channel. Mickey Mantle, yes. Angel, yeah, I would love to see that too. But too bad, yeah, that's like just more for MLB The Show. Thank you for the Twitch link, Sierra. Yes. Thank you, Sierra. Thank you for the Twitch link. Yeah, that's our Twitch link in the chat right there. We'll be on Twitch after this. We'll be uh, streaming some Call of Duty Black Ops 3. We'll be joined by our favorite uh, characters. We do also do voice impressions on Twitch. We can personally be with some butthead and other characters as well. Working on a few other characters too. Thank you, Angel. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Sierra and Angel. Yeah, we've been live streaming now for no one hour. Thank you to everybody for joining us. Uh, earlier, we did our review of our McCafe Mocha Frappe beverage here. Rochelle, how are you? The giant map? Uh, no, not yet, Tyler. I just started, so yeah. I was only on a zombies mode, and then I just started the campaign last night. Welcome, Rochelle. How are you? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining us. How are you this evening? But yeah, I'm still a uh, Jewish redneck prepper, so how are you? Thank you for joining us. How are you today? Thank you for being here. Yeah, like I said before, for uh, MLB All-Star Home Run Derby prediction, it's Bryce Harper. That's who I think is going to win. Favorite team, Angel? Yeah, uh, my favorite team is the Nationals. Yeah, uh, reason, part of the reason why, too, is uh, in 2005, I took a class trip to Washington, D.C., and that was the first year where they moved from Montreal to Washington, D.C. to become the Nationals because they used to be the Expos in Montreal. For the Derby, I was sure. Oh, thanks, Carlos. I appreciate it. Yeah, I got to start watching that a little bit, too. I think, I think it's on Fox. Because I, I can just watch it, too, for a little bit. The map is really good. You can literally get to round 15 or two. Oh, okay, cool, Tyler. Yeah. I'm still trying to, like, uh, find my way around in both the zombies mode and then the campaign mode. But, yeah. Uh, I also sent our Discord, too. If you guys want to, if you guys want to see more zombie mode or us to continue the campaign, you can also let us know on Discord as well. But, yeah, thanks, Carlos. Yeah. Should be a fun home run derby. Thanks for uh, stopping in. It was good talking to you. Good meeting you. And uh, enjoy the home run derby. We'll see you later. And thank you for joining us, Rochelle. That's our Discord link, too, if you'd like to join our Discord as well. Uh, also, like I said, uh, we updated our Discord, asking our community if they want us to have separate voice channels where we do our different voice impressions. They want to have a Beavis voice channel, a Butthead voice channel, a Tracer voice channel. Tracer's a character from Overwatch. Be open to doing that. Try to, like, make our Discord a little more different than, like, other Discord servers that are out there. I don't know. Yeah, it's like, we'll also still have the voice impressions on Twitch. I hope you're enjoying your uh, cheese pizza, Sierra. And Judge actually killed it. Oh, agreed, Angel. Oh, I know. Aaron Judge is like one of the best rookies I've seen in a while. I'll give I'll give Aaron Judge a lot of props. He's like, I don't know, this season, yeah, I mean, it was hard to follow up his rookie season, but yeah, he, he's going to be a great player for years to come. Yeah, he crushed Yeah, he literally crushed it last year's home run derby. But yeah, this year I think it's going to be Bryce. He's got the home field advantage. It's going to be his year. Baez, we'll see. We'll see. But yeah, I wonder like I'll watch part of that too. It's not gonna be a long Twitch stream, but yeah, we'll watch part of it. Doing it. Oh, great, Sierra. Where did you go to Domino's? You gotta get the. T oh, which uh, if you just got like one cheese pizza, you probably could have gotten two medium, two topping pizzas. You probably could have gotten it for roughly the same price. You just take the toppings off, but it'll still be cheaper. Agreed, Angel. Yeah, and it's like a. Oh man, agreed. So like it's just like every time he swings the bat, he knows he has so much confidence where there's a really good chance he'll either crush it, just either just pass the fence or just like well into the stands. It's like it's a confident swing when he swings the bat. Even despite all his injuries too. It's like his swing is still yeah, it's smooth and it's solid. Soto? Yeah, I like Soto too. Like I wish I got I wish I had uh the MLB uh T V pass on my uh for cable. I don't, I just like to watch whatever I can online. But yeah, I think I just like, I don't think I get the games on Reddit too. But yeah. But I can't wait to see this home run derby too. It should be fun. Yeah, killer pitch. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah Soto. Yeah. I know uh, Tanaka too, last, I think he was, Masashiro Tanaka was uh, pitching last night. I think he was pitching last night? Or was it Saturday? One of the two was pitching against the Indians too. And then uh, you Darvish too. I don't know how Darvish is going to do. 
I don't know, Darvish too, yeah. I thought like everybody was like uh, trying to talk him up, but yeah, Darvish isn't really that good, to be honest. I had to deliver Papa John's. Oh, okay. All right, gotcha, Sierra. Ooh. Yeah, I like the uh, two medium, two topping pizza for $5.99 from Domino's. That was like my favorite too. It's just like a better deal. But yeah, thank you to everybody for joining us. Seeing 22 likes on the live stream. Thank you everybody for smashing that like button. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat here. See me in their contest of Jay would interest you. Offer feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions. I'll improve the quality of the content if you'd like to do it. Also, you know somebody who is interested in the content as well? Share that content as on your social media accounts. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, the All-Star Ray. I think it's starting like past 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Wrestler, how are you? <laughs> thank you. Yes, I did, Wrestler. Yeah, I got to uh, figure out which questions I want to pick. I did get it, and then... Uh, I did get your email, but yeah, I was going to answer. Oh, he said, Kit Kat, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining us. How are you today? Thank you for joining us, wrestler. Thank you both for being here. But yeah, that was, a, that was another thing I forgot to announce. Yeah, I'm working on a, a collab with a wrestler as well. To, um, it's for part of his uh, Spotlight Live uh, interviews. They just uh, interviewing other YouTubers. So the uh, final video, when a wrestler gets done editing down our part of the interview, you'll be seeing that on his channel as well. So that's, uh, like I said before, from our uh, recent channel uh, updates and changes that we said, we wanted to collaborate more with other YouTubers as well. So now uh, we're still moving forward with another collab right here. So yeah, I got to figure out which questions I'm going to pick. Yeah, I want some pizza too. Actually, I don't know if I'm just going to get like Domino's or just like uh, go get a frozen pizza too because I know the Home Run Derby is coming up because I don't want to miss like miss any part of it. But yeah, we already announced our, uh, I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. Oh, I'm doing good. Thank you for asking, KitKat. Things are good. Oh, uh, yeah, we already announced our MLB Hall, All-Star Home Run Derby uh, prediction early on the last stream. We also did a review of this uh, McCafe uh, Frappe beverage as well. Land Manny. Hope the Yankees do. Oh, I wouldn't be surprised if Manny ends up there. So I'm not sure, but who knows. Schwarber? Shazer, <laughs> Omari, welcome to the stream. I'm not trying to pronounce your... Uh, GX, uh, GX, I'm not trying to pronounce your... Uh, Channel name, I apologize if I'm pronouncing wrong. Schwaber? Ooh. I don't know. We'll see. I'm thinking Bryce. But yeah, uh, only time will tell. Oh, you do? Yeah. I No, I was saying before, Kick, yeah, we gave a review earlier. Unless you want to hear the full review, get to like, watch the replay. But yeah, basically for this, I was just saying a suggestion I have for just not McDonald's, but Dunkin' Donuts and Starbucks is just either allow for more customization by ordering like your own custom bottled beverages either from a retailer or somewhere else. To have them deliver to you because like uh if you go to a mcdonald's or a coffee house or starbucks you can have it customized and made more specifically to your taste because this uh just in general these are either these aren't bad but they said uh, just taste too generic it just tastes like oh, pretty much like everything else and out oh i'm saying the ale i i'm gonna say the ale i don't know it's just we'll see we'll see yeah but i was gonna give uh more of an analysis of the actual all-star game later in the week because uh, tonight's just a home run we wanted to focus on that He's going to trade to L.A. You think so? I don't know. We'll see. Okay, we'll see. What, uh, I don't know. Schwarber. So, uh, Carl said Baez. I'm saying Bryce Harper. Angel said Bryce Harper. AL is loaded to be compared to the NL. Oh, agreed. Yeah. Especially for pitching, too. AL is stacked. I mean, plus, yeah, but between the Yankees, Red Sox, and Astros, that's, and then maybe the Mariners, if you want to throw in the Mariners, you really only need four more of the teams to go up against the NL, for the most part. Oh, uh, perfect font to best for people who don't realize it's bad. <laughs> I name. <laughs> J.D. Martinez should have been in it. Yeah, um, you know what I was surprised? I'm surprised, I don't know why they didn't put Aaron Judge back in. The home run champ, or not, not Aaron Judge. Uh, I think, uh, well, I'm so sorry, uh, Encarnacion wasn't in it. I figured uh, Edwin, Edwin Encarnacion from the Indians should have been in it. I'm not an Indians fan, but I felt like he should have been in it. I think the Cleveland's going to host the uh, All-Star Game 2 coming up in a future year. Not too uh, long down the road. I think in... Uh, when are they going to host it? It's like 20... Either next year or 2020, something like that. You know, uh, yeah, I was like, when he's batting 7th. Yeah, a lot of people say it's messed up. You're so... Manny. Yeah. Agreed, Angel. Yeah. Is it, wasn't Bryce batting 6th? But yeah. I thought it was batting six, but yeah, if he's seventh, yeah, that, that's how you know you're, you're pretty much the whole lineup is your wrecking crew. Pretty much every single out you will have to earn. It'll be some of the toughest outs you'll ever get, and you'll be happy that, wow, I'm glad interleague play isn't the whole season. I'm just glad that they only just try to contain interleague play. Yeah, that is funny, Russell. Yeah, it is backwards. 
But yeah, it's just uh, it's a Miami Beach shirt. As as I bought this when I was in uh, Miami. But yeah, this should be a fun home run derby. I'll probably talk more about the All Star game itself uh, as the day approaches. But thank you to everybody for being here. Seeing 23 likes on the live stream. Thanks everybody for smashing that like button. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat here. See if any of their concepts are genuine interest to you. The Grom is. Oh yeah. Like, some of, I just gotta like look more into some of these players too. Just like read up more about them. I wanted to spend more time like uh just like uh watching more MLB games, but I've been like tied up in the World Cup before, and then uh, with basketball, I was just looking at uh, NBA free agency. I wanted to spend more time with the MLB. If you also know somebody who is interested in the content here, share with them on your social media accounts. Also, uh, offer feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions. Hope with the quality of the content of everybody here in the chat. If you uh, have any to offer, agree. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, are all, I mean, uh, Yankees have, they still have Chapman, they have Tanaka, ESPN. Oh, uh, the Homer Derby? I thought it was on Fox, but maybe it is probably ESPN. Maybe you're right. I thought it was on Fox, maybe you're right. Probably is ESPN. That was my fault. Yeah. You've been to Vice City, yeah, right, typical? Yeah, it has a very Vice City inspired shirt. I mean, Vice City is based off of Miami, what it was in the 80s. Yeah, it's like, uh, oh, it's like the uh, Robot Chicken sketch, too. <laughs> it's like the one where, like, the Mario Brothers, like, uh, Go to like a Grand Theft Auto inspired city. That was a funny. Yeah, if you haven't seen Robot Chicken, that show, that's funny. But uh, yeah. Uh, the Nats picking up Herrera. Oh. I don't know. I'm not convinced that Herrera would be the best thing for us. Really, for uh, for our team, what I would like to see either is another big bat or a really good pitcher. We need a more work in our bullpen as well. We need a bullpen work. No, I don't think we'll ever get, um, because we had great pitching before, too, and then we uh, lost everybody, like, uh, this past year or two. We lost all our good, most of our good pitchers before, but yeah. I either want a big bat, but Herrera, I'm not sure Herrera would be the best thing, best player for us. I either want another big bat, and, uh, mostly our bullpen needs work, because we need to, like, start holding on to games, and we win, we gotta hold on to the wins, because we're too inconsistent, and when we do end up, you know, we get a lead, we end up giving it up a lot of time. Moose. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah. I forget. Uh, when is uh, MLB uh, trade deadline? It's coming up soon. Yeah, Panther. Yep, we're still here. Yeah, bro. Yeah, hope your uh, trip went well. I hope you got everything taken care of. Yeah, I mean, we've been live now for uh, just over 72 minutes. Uh, Brad Hanna or Iglesias would be ideal. Yeah, Iglesias I would like as well. I'm more of a, yeah, Iglesias probably be better for us. But yeah, we just need a, we need a solid bullpen first. If we want to make any run at the division, like a serious run, and even after, like a run into like uh, the uh, end of October, we need a better bullpen. I'll grab one of those frozen on the way home. Ooh, nice. The uh, one, at, oh, at McDonald's, oh, that's cool. Frozen cough. What do you think of it, Sean? I know it's no natty rush, but still. I mean, we, yeah, yep, enjoy, agree, yep. Because Strasburg, too, yeah. I just wish he didn't get hurt so much. Strasburg and Harper could have been even better, even, like, my more. But all the injuries got caught up to him. It's about 7 out of 10. I know it's no natty rush. <laughs> 7 out of 10, all right. You know, 7's a passing grade in school. Well, it depends on which school you go to. But yeah, even though we're only five and a half back in the division at an average watermelon the other day. Yeah, you, you said that too, Sean. Yeah, and the watermelon one. I don't know why they thought putting beer and watermelon together would be a good idea. It's like, oh, you know what? Let's call it a drink. Here, sell it. I'm sure people won't mind how a, a drink tastes. They'll just drink it. I'm sure taste isn't important. But yeah, we need a better bullpen. I'll say for the Nationals. The Cardinals too. Uh... Carpenter, yeah. I guess if they have to play the Cubs, too, they're kind of, yeah, they don't. Mm. It's going to be tough for the Cardinals to climb up in the division, too. Just looking up on the Cubs, they have the more put together team. Do I think Harper will resign? Oh, uh, will re sign? Um, part of it is going to be, too, is uh, one, it's salary cap. Uh, two, depending upon uh, how our team does this season. And three, if there's anybody else in free agency we can pick up. Come alive here. Oh, agreed. So, I don't know. Carlos has just been uh, meandering. You're like us, too, for the Nationals. We've just been meandering. And we just started off okay. Then we started falling off. Joyful, how are you? Welcome to the stream. 
Thumbs up and a view. Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't know Michael's features are. That's awesome. Thank you to Michael Malloy for featuring us. Now I have to do that. Thank you, Michael. Thank you, sir. But how are you today, Joyful? Thanks for uh, joining us. Oh, no problem, Joyful. Yeah, but thanks for being here. Thanks for stopping by. Showing support for our channel. Appreciate it. I uh, hope your live stream goes well. Uh, yeah, then we're going to be on Twitch after this uh, for a little bit as well. But yeah, thank you for stopping in. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you for being here. I see 24 likes on the live stream. Thank you, everybody, for smashing that like button. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat here. See if any of their concepts of genuine interest to you. I'll feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions to help improve the quality of the content. You can also know somebody's interested in the content as well. Share with them on your social media accounts. What I would like to see eventually, I don't think we'll ever happen. I would love to see Encarnacion with the Nationals. I don't think that trade will ever happen. I would love to see Encarnacion in a Nats uniform. That would be awesome. Because I'm surprised he wasn't in the home run derby. It's kind of surprised. But, yeah. Because, yeah. The, oh, man. It's like, like I said. But I still think AL is going to win the uh, All-Star game. So they're too stacked of a league to lose. But, you know, who knows? We'll wait. Yeah, the Nationals need to like, start like, getting the whole team together. It's just like we're missing a lot of pieces, but we definitely still have a decent core overall, too, where we could still be competitive if we actually play consistently enough. It's kind of it's like weird too, but like the Indians do, even though they have good players, they don't, I don't know. They're just not really like overall, they don't always like consist, they're not too consistent. But because of the division that they're in, which is called, you know, the AL Central on my phone, it just like stopped working. But yeah, I have, uh, believe Harper leaves, you guys will be all right because they truly think so. Yeah, I agree, Angel. Yeah, we're back now. So yeah, sorry for like my phone having technical difficulties. But yeah, so I think it filled the place. But yeah, uh, Bryce Harper leaving would be, uh, that'd be a huge loss for us. Now, depending on salary cap, like I said before, I don't know in terms of the value uh, management's going to decide. But, yeah, we'll see. But, yeah, sorry about that, guys. Yeah, we're back now. Uh, let me see if I missed anything in the chat. Uh, no. I'm sure I might buy for yours. But, yeah, I'm glad I found you, Michaels. All right, thank you, Joey. For, thanks for bringing our notification bell. And thank you again. All right, uh, we're back. Yep, we're back. Hey, thank you, Michael Malloy. Thank you for... Uh, Recommending Joyful Show to our channel. Thank you. Hey, VOV girl. Welcome. How are you? It's been a while. Thank you for joining us this evening. How have you been? I don't know if you've... Uh, are you continuing Beyond Two Souls by any chance? See, I, don't, I don't know if you are or not. Maybe I just like, missed another part that you may have uploaded. Because I know uh, you've done live streams where you just like have people uh, invite them to chat and hang out. Um, you've uploaded like other videos as well. But I'm not sure uh, if you uh, are going to continue that game or not. I'm obviously not going to spoil it. I've already uh, finished the game, but I'm just wondering. I was just curious. But thank you. Yeah, thank you everybody for being patient with us, too. Yeah, sorry for the technical difficulties we had before. It's like my phone just stopped working. Like I said, a perfect day to maybe like look into a new phone or something like that because uh, it's Prime Day, and I saw a deal for 128 gig phone for only $250, so I'm probably doing a little bit here and there. Oh, all right, all right, I understand. You've been busy with work. That's that's all good. Yeah, also, uh, we updated our Discord as well, asking our community um, if they would like us to include uh, voice channels where we uh, give our voice impressions, where we have a separate voice channel for each voice. Uh, just to uh, try to uh, help our Discord server, just to make it stand out a little more. Ask that in our Discord. Also, if you'd like to, uh, for our Call of Duty Black Ops 3 stream later at Twitch, if they want us to continue the campaign mode, or if they want us to go back to the zombies mode, you can let us know in our Discord. Yeah, but we're, all, we're back now, yeah. I don't know, probably something I'm not getting a new phone. But well, thank you everybody uh, for being here. Now we're seeing uh, 25 likes on a live stream. Thank you everybody for smashing that like button. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat here. See if any of their contents are genuinely interested to you. feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions to improve the quality of the content. If you also know somebody's interested in the content as well, share with them on your social media accounts. I wish the people, yeah, probably some people are thinking it was like, are we going to end? But yeah, I'm going to come back or not. That's all good. I'm going to get ready to go live on Twitch soon. Resorian, long time no see. How have you been? Thank you for joining us. Hope you're, uh, the rest of your day is going well. Thank you for being here. Yeah, we're just, uh, we shared our MLB All-Star uh, Home Run Derby prediction. We also did a review of our, uh, 
McCafe Mocha Frappe, a review of this beverage as well. Uh, we also shared some Discord updates as uh, also during the live stream. But yeah, should be a fun home run derby tonight. Yeah, overall, like I was saying before, uh, for this uh, bar frappe beverage here too, suggestion I have is uh, allow for, uh, find some way to have uh, people, if they want to order these, uh, help uh, order in advance, have like a customized beverage for this as well. I'm not sure uh, how they were able to pull that off, but someday that would be a suggestion I have. And also just try to make it taste like more like it was like a fresh beverage you would get. Either well, you get this at the McDonald's one, the Dunkin' Donuts, Starbucks, beverage, or whatever coffee house you go to. It's not too bad, but yeah. Obviously, the fresher it tastes would be the better. So, I don't know if you're going to watch the home run derby tonight. I hope Levi has been behaving. And Levi's his son, too. That's Rosarian's son, too. That's who I'm referring to. And also, we'll be playing some more Call of Duty Black Ops 3 later in the on Twitch. We'll be starting up with that pretty soon. But thank you again to everybody who joined us on the live stream today. I've seen 25 likes. Thank you, everybody, for smashing that like button. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat here. See if any of their contents of genuine interest to you. Our feedback, tips, advice, and suggestions to improve the quality of the content. If you also know somebody who's interested in the uh, chat or the content as well, share with them on your social media accounts. I don't know why my phone just like, keeps giving me uh, trouble too. I thought like clearing some space on my phone might have helped too, but I don't know what it is. Well, luckily, you know, maybe just a. Uh, hey, uh, entertain! <laughs> yeah, uh, glad you made it back safe from your. Uh, trip to the store thank you for joining us again but yeah uh i don't know if, uh, did you say who you thought was gonna win the home run derby tonight i don't know if you are, are gonna watch it or not but yeah i said bryce harper i think that's who's gonna win we've had uh baez where's the uh so just... du, 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 du. no Perez. no no what was it oh What's the other uh, player? Schwarber. I think Schwarber was the other one as well. I think Schwarber was. I think uh, she she rocks or something. Are we watching the All Star Weekend? Yeah, I am entertained. <laughs> Super Bowl man. I'll take entertained. Yep, that's funny. <laughs> Super Bowl. <man. laughs> uh, we're growing more than I thought. Well, you know, it's a good sign. I guess we're growing more than I thought. But yeah, especially I want to watch the uh, yeah the uh, All Star game too. But yeah, tonight's just a home run derby. Yeah, I think uh, Bryce Harper's going to have the best chance to take it to the home field advantage. Watch my out of touch. Yeah, like you said. Oh, yeah, you're right. My fault. Yeah, you did say that. I should have remembered. Yeah, you did say you're out of touch with current players. You did say that. Yeah, I should have remembered. Yeah, I think it's going to be Bryce Harper. Maybe a little bit of bias being a Nationals fan, but we'll see. Oh, my phone died. And my maybe laptop is being slow. No, no problem, Rosario. Yeah, I'm having phone issues, too. Not with my phone dying, just, you know, phone, my phone just stopped working. Just like, that's why. Before, that's why it was like uh, the stream stopped before. Just having technical difficulties. Just wish I need to have like a nice uh, intermission uh, card too. I need to have make those too. I am back, Sarah. Yeah, I'm back. I think the rest of the people probably didn't think, uh, they probably thought the stream was over. But that's all right. Yeah, I mean, yeah, they probably thought it ended, but yeah. Ugh. All the reason why you just to get a PC or a laptop to stream. That way I can like uh, make these streams more presentable too. I don't just have to use my phone. Judge guy, but I think he's only playing in the game. Yeah, Aaron Judge. Yeah, he's uh, it's his second year, but yeah, he's only going to be in uh, uh, the All Star game. Yeah, I'm surprised he didn't make the home runs. Right? I'm surprised he wasn't invited back. I'm surprised Encarnacion wasn't in it. But yeah. I don't know when the next UFC fight's coming up, too. That's when that is. And like you said, uh, there's uh, Japanese wrestling, too, uh, as well. Uh, so the Tour de France is uh, happening. So, yeah, a lot of different sporting events going on now, right in the summer. I'm sure the World Cup just ended. Wimbledon, I think, was last uh, this past weekend. I think it was like the John Deere Classic as well for golf. So, yeah, a lot of different events going on. I would like to see entertain. I would like to see you doing, like, a sports podcast or, like, uh, just do sports commentary on your channel. I would like to see that. 
It's like I know a uh, big red bear who was uh, here before. Yeah, he has like a sports show that he has with a co-host. You could do something like that. I like to see that. But thank you again to everybody uh, for uh, being here on our live stream. See 25 likes on the live stream. Thank you everybody for being here. Continue to get to know everybody in the chat here. See me in the contents of genuine interest to you. Offer feedback, tips, about questions to help improve the quality of the content. You can also know somebody's interested in the content as well. Share with them on your social media accounts. And also to uh, entertain some suggestion, I probably uh, give people a bit of a tutorial video for Discord as well, like you did for Twitch. That actually be a good idea as well. I think more people should. Uh, like we said, us we recently started updating our uh, Discord server more. I think more people should need to start utilizing it more. But yeah, I think like a, I wish we could do like a tutorial series or something like that to get people more interested to it. Because a lot of it's like Twitch. I think it's just for gamers, but really it should just be a really it combines. Um, like with Skype and not Facebook Messenger, I guess like uh, Skype and uh, Speaks. What's the other one? Team Speak, I guess. Team Speak and then Skype, maybe like a a Messenger as well, I guess. And then like uh, combines all of those into like one app. But yeah, I'll probably wrap up the live stream here soon. Anyway, we get set up for Twitch. We're getting close to that ninety minute mark on our live streams. Then also we updated our uh, Discord server as well, asking uh, everybody on our server, uh, in our community, uh, if they want us to add like uh, voice channels based upon the different voice impressions that we do. Yeah. Oh, Green Entertain, yeah. Isn't it still technically in beta? It's still technically in beta, I think, right? Or they or past beta now. That's what I think. Maybe I'm wrong. But yeah. Surprised something like this was invented before. But yeah, also for the voice channels too on our Discord, I would like to add like the different voice impressions that we do. I like to add those as voice channels, so if people want to hear those too, they can just go to a particular voice mic. Do that as well. That's something I would like to do as well. Just try to make our uh, our community a little uh, differentiate ourselves a little more. But also, like I said, we have our craft beer review coming up later week. So uh, just gotta figure out which day we're gonna do that. All right, no problem, Siri. I'll see you there in a little. We're gonna wrap up the live stream here soon, anyway. Just get set up for Twitch. So, yeah, because I get to the gym later tonight. Not sure, but it's always changing for the better. All right. Yeah, agreed. I would just like to say, um, I've noticed, like, for their site as well, I would like them to have, like, a mobile or desktop website where you can just log into your account. I don't know why you just only have to use the app. I guess it's fine for now. But, yeah, when you log in, just to me, I noticed, I guess it's, like, when you go in, it just looks like the general just homepage where you, uh, even if you log in, maybe it's just me. Maybe I never just logged in, but, yeah, it just seems like this just take you immediately to, like, the login screen if you can. Use it for desktop or uh, a mobile website, such as the app. What game is the BO3? Yep, that's right, Entertain. Yes, sir. Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Also, yeah, there's like another series that I wanted to uh, continue, or at least we did our first episode of it starting uh, for Twitch. Oh, it's called Midnight Fights. We already did like uh, our first one. Uh, it's like when we played GTA 5, where uh, all we do is just pretty much cause as much mayhem and fighting and uh, uh, of that as much as we can. Uh, Beavis is a big part of that as well. But yeah, that's like another series we just wanted to start. It's just pretty much like uh like your standard fight, but just like pretty much that's all we're gonna do is just pretty much pretty much just turn it into like uh I don't know. Kind of like Battle Royal, but without the it's Battle Royal. It's just like uh just more fun. Yeah, that's just something I wanted to like think about starting to, but yeah, I'm gonna update everybody on our disc age so well still. Agreed, oh, Angie. Yeah, it did. It did, yeah. And with the once they first they made that jump uh, with GTA 3 into 3D with the uh, sandbox style that we know of it now, that's what made it uh, pretty much uh, left its life. But anyway, guys, yeah, I think I'm going to wrap up the live stream here so we can get set up for Twitch. I want to thank everybody for being here. Thank you to all the new people uh, who came here today. Carlos, Angel, uh, thanks to everybody, all of our regulars are here. Thank you to Joy Fultz Show and Michael Malloy. Thank you again. For your support, as always, thank you, Entertain, Sierra, Chris, and all of our other mods who are here as well. Tyler, thank you to everybody for being here. Thank you for all your help and for your support of our channel. Uh, we'll get set up for Twitch here. We're going to uh, stream some more Call of Duty Black Ops 3. If you'd like to uh, know more of the updates and uh, just uh, between uh, our uh, future uh, potential voice channels that we'll have on our Discord, check out our Discord as well. Thank you to everybody for being here. When we are done on YouTube, you already know what time it is. It'll be time to switch to Twitch. We'll see you guys over on Twitch. Yeah, absolutely entertaining. I'll catch you over there in a little bit. 
We'll probably get started around 8.45 p.m. Uh, give or take, so it'll be 7.45 for you. Just give me a little bit of time just to get set up on Twitch. Thank you, everybody, for being here again on our YouTube live stream. We'll see you guys over on Twitch in just a little while.